they did not have a framework. They did not uh, draw lines within which they're going to uh, spend, they're going to uh, live their lives. You know, we should know how much enough is enough. When you have an amount of money and you go to a shop, you need to have a budget and you need to know how much you're going to spend on that dress, how much you're going to spend on that birthday cake, how much you're going to spend on, you know, that dinner that night, you know. And that's so important. You know, we just can't say that, oh, I believe God's going to supply me, so I don't have a budget. I'm going to just do what I want to do. And that's not going to work. That's not faith. That's presumption. That's presumption. You know, we need to live within our means. And that is wisdom. God wants us to do that. First Timothy chapter 6, verse 6. Now, godliness with contentment is great gain. So, godliness, which is actually having true fellowship with the Lord and contentment, that is living within your means, is going to help you have great gains in life. You're going to be blessed financially. And verses uh, 7 and 8 tell us, For we brought nothing into this world, and it is certain we can carry nothing out, and having food and clothing with these, we shall be content. So contentment. If someone is not able to budget or draw four lines like a squire, you know, and if that someone is not going to learn within that squire, you know, if they're going to say, I don't need these lines, you know, I don't need these territories, you know, I just just live the way I want to. First of all, there can never be satisfaction in such a person's life because satisfaction comes only if you learn to define your boundaries. So you reach that boundaries and you say, thank God, Lord, thank you for giving me what I needed and I'm grateful. Thank you for the food. Thank you for the clothing. Thank you for the shelter. And I'm content. And that kind of a life, that kind of a lifestyle is going to help you walk out of any financial uh, trap or bondage you may have gotten into over the past 